Follow this simple instruction to change the thumbstick module of the Azeroth Classic or Compact. For this guide, you will need tweezers, hex and flathead screwdrivers included in the Classic and Compact packages. Unplug the keypad. Unscrew the screws to remove the palm rest. Use the screwdriver provided in the Azeroth package. Remove the screws that hold the casing. Do not take off the casing right away. Take a picture of these wires to make sure you reconnect them correctly later on. Take the flathead screwdriver. You'll have to remove the LED lights first. Release the two screws that hold these two wires on the teensy board. Do not screw these screws completely out. Release the screw that holds the ground wire from the ground distribution block. The black ground wire can be put into any slot of the ground distribution block. Pull out the three wires and put aside the casing. Take the hex screwdriver. Remove the screws that hold the USB cable. Take a picture of these wires before you take them out on the teensy board. Take the flathead screwdriver. Remove the five-way switch set of wires. Remove the analog stick set of wires. This set includes a ground wire going to the ground distribution block. The black ground wire can be put into any slot of the ground distribution block, so make sure you are unscrewing the right wire. Once unscrewed, gently pull out the wires. Take the hex screwdriver. Remove these screws to take off the thumbstick module. Remove the thumbstick. Install the other thumbstick module. Screw it down. Take the flathead screwdriver. Attach a five-way switch set of wires to the teensy board. Use your reference photos to make sure the wires are in the correct place. Place the wires under the board and not above it. Make sure the screws are contacting the bare wire and not the insulation. Attach the thumbstick wires to the teensy and the ground distribution block. Use your reference photos to make sure the wires are in the correct place. You can put the ground wire into any slot of the block. Once the wires are secured, double check them with a very light pull to make sure they are attached. Now gently put the teensy board back into place. Do not break off the reset button. Make sure that the reset button on the bottom of the teensy board lines up with the corresponding slot on the base. Take the hex screwdriver. Tighten the screws that hold the USB cable and teensy board.
Take the flathead screwdriver. Reattach the LED wires to the teensy and ground distribution block. Use your reference photos to make sure the wires are in the correct place. Plug the keypad into the PC and make sure all the keys, five-way switch, and the thumbstick are working. If not, check the connections referencing the photos you have taken earlier. Remember to unplug the keypad before troubleshooting. Make sure the paracords go in corresponding openings and are not strained, otherwise you might not be able to adjust the towers later on. Once everything is working, screw down the casing. Use hex screwdriver. Place the palm rest on the keypad and screw it down. Carefully screw down the palm rest and make sure you do not squeeze any wires. Have fun gaming with your new thumbstick!